Okay, they, these are the Mill Valley Art Festival drawings that I was asked to uh, go to the music stage and draw to my heart's content. So I spent a weekend drawing, and this is Dear John, Love Renee. Um, I know her from another band, but it's so great to see this new composition of theirs, and it was really fun to draw in the redwoods. Great stage, but I realized drawing in color would be an issue in 45 minutes producing all these drawings. So here I started to do work on, you know, color hues, but only a few colors because it ended up being really hard to pull it all off with five people on stage for 45 minutes. And then I wanted to add the children because they were so cute dancing. And of course, I finished these in the studio. But to be working on these in front of a, over 50 people sitting in the audience, I don't know how many people, it really took a lot of daring for me because usually I work really small on the books. So making these bigger drawings was a stretch. And I feel pretty good about the way they look. And it's interesting, the ones that people like, what one of my friends really loves these stacks of jazz musicians. And then Barrio Manouche, they're kind of a favorite band of mine, so I really like them. And uh, Javier started this band, and I really think it's great, so it's really fun. But that was the one I really tried to do all the colors in the rainbow there, and it was took a while. It was fast drawing. And then the John Henry Hands on Fire is a new band for me, and he brought all these children up on stage with him, and I just love the heart and soul that he showed, and I hope it comes through in the drawings. Laura Lee Christensen, then I finally realized that if I just drew one person, it could be excellent, and of course, since it was her band, I felt it was okay to just draw her. And it was very fun because she came over after and she said, no one ever draw, drew me before. And so I got a picture of her with her drawing, which was pretty fun to do. And then I got the same thing with Pete Madsen, just one person, and it made it ever so much more doable. And I could actually almost finish those. And that is the eight drawings that I did at the Mill Valley Art Festival. And then this is my series on waiting, which I started trying to learn being still, being quiet has always been a real problem for me. And as I am usually pushing the river, doing something, just trying to shake it up and make it happen, I'm learning to be still and to take some time to rest, to be quiet, a meditation on waiting and life drawing. And the most interesting part of it is that I had to come to this after having a car wreck and somebody front-ending me and having whiplash. And I did all of these drawings at the Mill Valley Art Festival after the accident. So I really did have to take some time to catch my breath. And it was very hard to be still, but I'm learning it. And uh, I really enjoyed working on these still life drawings. And I love this book because I got to go to Brennan's and get my own personal bananas foster. And that's the cover of the book. But uh, the monk Boudreaux, getting to see him and all of these great artists was really fun. And getting to meet a lot of them and, and just enjoy it was a great treat. And it was really exciting to be at the French Quarter Fest, and I'm really honored that they allow me to get up close and personal with all of these artists. I have a press pass, which is fun. So that was April. So this is Hardly Strictly Bluegrass 2015, and it was an issue because I had a sprained ankle and whiplash and uh, vertigo, but I still went to the festival and spent two days drawing. I couldn't go to many stages, but I think the simplicity of just being able to draw a few of the acts, uh, I think it, people really like this book. And I really like this thing in the back where I did the cloudy thing with all these swans because the swans represent Warren Hellman's wife 
at Swan Lake and the banjo, and they're all of the um, trademarks of Harley Strictly Bluegrass, the rooster. And I really enjoyed so much all of these musicians.